Investors and IRAs are the key to building reusable assets that can be used throughout a project or even across projects. Along with templates and styles, they can greatly accelerate the process of building software visualizations in IRAs. In this video, we'll create a header master for our simulation. We'll start out simple, partly to show how low fidelity masters can be used for basic wireframes, and partly to show how your use of masters can increase your speed as you update your simulations. Let's start out by creating a folder in our directory panel to hold all of our reusable assets. Now we can create our header master within this folder. The workspace for a master looks a little different from that of a page, but the capabilities are the same. You can add any page widget inside the master's boundaries and any canvas widget outside them. Let's change the dimensions of the master to a typical header size. Mainly so we can see the master when we add it to a page, we'll apply a background color. Since our initial use of this master will be as a placeholder, let's add a simple text label. With our simple master built, now we can add it to the pages where it belongs. With the page displayed in the workspace, just drag the master from the directory and release it on the page. We can adjust the positioning of the master either with our mouse or with the XY coordinates in the properties panel. Once we have the master properly positioned, we can copy and paste to the other pages. Even though our master now appears on three different pages in our project, there is still only one master. You can see this by right-clicking the master and choosing Find References. This concept is important to understand, since this is what enables a master's most important feature. Let's say we're ready to start visualizing some of the functional requirements for a header. We can go back into the master either by selecting it in the directory panel or by double-clicking any instance on a page. We've been given the requirement that our company logo should appear in the header and should link to our home page. Easy enough. First we'll add the logo with an image widget, and then we'll connect that image to a link widget that goes out to our website. Now let's take a look at the pages that contain our header. As you can see, the change we made to our master is reflected on each of the pages that reference the master. You can disable this dynamic link for any master you've added to a page by right-clicking the master and choosing Break Master Reference. This converts the master to a section that you can then edit in place without affecting the master. Although we used a simple example here, masters can be used for any content that will get repeated use in your projects. Their versatility and reusability make them an indispensable component of pattern libraries built in iRise, but even small scale use can be a huge time saver, especially if you combine them with styles and templates. Thanks for watching.